Yo, you guys, good morning. It is now like 4.42. This is usually the time I get up in the mornings just because I usually have a crazy, crazy busy day ahead of me. And getting up early just allows me to kind of have a little time in my, you know, clear headspace, time by myself, time to just kind of, you know, reply to my emails, do my text messages, do a little workout and stuff like that before I get my day started, which is super, super nice. you guys so we now just got our workout done just a quick little 10 minute run so now i'm gonna head back up to the place usually right now i go to the pool and take a little jump in the pool if it was like the weekend but you guys since it's a weekday right now and i'm showing you guys a day in the life at the office i'm not gonna do so so you guys with that being said i'm gonna go get an outfit on i'm gonna go get dressed so I'm now officially basically all ready for the day you guys I literally wear the same exact thing every day you guys the reason that I wear like a similar thing or the same thing every day is for a specific reason I actually heard this from Mark Zuckerberg he wears the same thing every single day so he can limit the choices that he makes outside of business decisions and one thing you'll find out in business is when you're a business owner you are basically just a decision maker a firefighter somebody who has to make decisions and has to make the right decision literally all the time you guys so that's why I ended up just literally completely like ditching my wardrobe I still have everything that like you know all the designer stuff and stuff that I bought but I don't wear it anymore and I typically just wear my brand and literally black jeans just because it's easy I have like a hundred of these shirts now all I'm gonna do is literally head to go pick up Justin who's actually a member of the crystalline media team you guys all right you guys so before I do go I always have to miss my gecko for those of you who don't know I have a crested gecko his name's Tico and crested geckos live in like tropical climates that's why his cage looks all literally all like tropical and all foresty look at him in the morning Ooh, it's all misty so you can't really see him but he's right there on the wall you guys quick little fun fact for you guys too before you get going I always have been taking cold showers literally since I got started in e-com like five six years ago you guys I just wanted to put that in here because I know I watched a YouTube video and somebody said it so I tried it and it literally changed my life it wakes you up it's better on your skin it makes you feel amazing you guys it's crazy crazy good you guys so definitely give a cold shower a try if you haven't yet I'll stop talking we'll get in the car and get going All right, you guys, so I completely forgot about this, but Justin just reminded me we're actually going to get tattoos today at five. Really want to do my neck, but I might do something on my back since I haven't yet on my chest. I don't know. We'll see. But we're at the gas station. 20 bucks right there. We just filled it up with that 20. We got that dude right back here. Forgot to turn off my car while we were getting gas, but it didn't explode, so we're all fine. Peace out, everybody. All right, you guys, so we just got to the office. I actually forgot my keys with my wallet up inside my office yesterday. Thankfully, one of the amazing members of Crystalline, Jen Williams, is on the way to come get me at the front door and unlock it for me. So we got Alex, Crystalline Media member. Hi, I'm Alex as well. You got to say the people. A little short line of inspiration morning. Good morning, America. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. slam this turkey pesto real quick as I get a little bit of busy work done so if you guys want to make money in e-commerce or make your first sale the first step is eating turkey pestos I know it's hard it's hard to be consistent with but you guys if you're really serious about it you would eat a turkey pesto you know what I mean all right, you guys, so when it comes to busy work, you guys, what I'm really doing is replying to emails, number one. I'm posting on social media. I'm replying to my Discord group chat that I keep of a bunch of people looking to get started in e-commerce, working on, you know, dealing with suppliers, replying to emails from people, dealing with VAs, things like that, whatever I need to do for like my brands and my personal stuff that's kind of outside of like my office work. Um, little stuff like that, I get done right away early in the morning. I like to knock that stuff out. It's usually super quick and, you know, doesn't take a lot of time. So that's kind of my busy work for the day. I'll also plan out if I'm gonna like, 
you know, post TikToks or what like we're gonna do for the morning meeting or what we're gonna be doing for the day in general. Um, so I kind of like to have that time before everybody else gets here to kind of gather my thoughts, be collected, and you know, get all the stuff that I need to do because yes, I run brands, but I also do a lot more, you guys. So I've got a lot of things going on at once and I like to kind of segment my time throughout the day to where, you know, when I'm working on say like my brands or doing laptop work like that, it's usually before the office or it's, you know, as soon as I get home throughout the day as well. I'm obviously taking calls, doing things like that. This is serious. There's an actual fire going on. We're going to have to run outside the office. So. Alright you guys, so I just got my tattoo done. It is now 8-12. This tattoo artist that I went to is actually absolutely insane. I threw up his out earlier so you guys can see it. I'll throw it up again if you guys didn't get the chance to see it. But this tattoo artist is literally the first tattoo artist from Tibet, which is where he's from, um, in the world, guys. He set a bunch of like tattoo artist records. He's been recognized in a ton of big articles. Definitely an insane story this artist has. So if you guys can, go ahead and go to the link in the description and follow his Instagram. Just check out his stuff. It's absolutely insane. And at the least, just give him a follow he's got a crazy story he moved here when he was young and basically you know started up a tattoo little empire for himself which is absolutely crazy and he's doing a lot of cool things on social media now it's basically 8 13 so it's a little late but I'm about to go to just a store and grab some like drinks and some stuff to possibly eat because I'm a little bit hungry I still got to go home and show you guys a couple things at the crib as well no matter how late it gets you guys that's the one thing about business making your own hours doing your own thing is that you know you work a lot of weird shifts right as I said this day in the life video is not planned I literally just wanted to take like a random day and be like oh I'm filming a day in the life so then you guys could actually see like the raw reality of you know what my life actually is because I feel like on social media so many people fluff it up and make it look like this and that and this and it's just not real and I wanted to show you guys an actual real day in the life so as I said you know I didn't do anything crazy so far it's nothing insane I'm just showing you guys exactly what it's really really like all right, you guys, so we are officially back at my place, and the first thing I do when I get home is feed this little guy. This is always like the first thing that I do. Cool fact about crested geckos is they're the only breed of gecko that can actually understand your voice, or not understand, but they have like vocal recognition, like he can understand who his owner is basically based off the voice. For those of you guys who don't know, I've had like geckos and like lizards and like exotic weird animals my whole life, and I know a lot of you are probably gonna be like in the comments like, what the f Now it's literally 10.51, I'm about to just hop on my computer reply to my last emails, get a little busy work done, check some sales, check some stats, and uh, go to bed, and then I'm gonna get back up. you guys so we are now sitting on my bedside actually exactly where we started this vlog and I just wanted to take a second to not only show you the new tattoo that I just got you guys you probably saw it earlier in the tattoo clips at the actual shop but you guys it's literally just my creator logo I want to explain the meaning of it because the reason I got this tattoo isn't because it's you know my logo of you know this brand that I might release to the public one day um, but it's really more than that and it really means a whole lot more than just you know a clothing brand but what this whole brand stands for is really my image and who I am as a person and who I you know inspire to help others you know be as well so first let me break down the tattoo so creator right the logo and then we've got 9704550503 Portland Oregon right 97045 is the area code um, or the zip code for the town that I grew up in called Oregon City small town right outside of Portland it's about 45 minutes away from where I live now and Oregon City is where I grew up it's where I started my first store it's where I went to high school where I went to elementary school literally everything very small city um, but it is amazing there's a lot of great people there and and I honestly, you know, had a great time growing up where I grew up. It was a small town. There obviously wasn't a lot of business owners or anything like that or anybody doing really anything, you know, crazy, right, or whatever. The whole creator thing and the whole brand and the whole, you know, image that I want to put out there for you guys through this brand is the fact that you guys can be creators of whatever you want. You guys can be creators of your reality. Whatever you guys put out to do, you guys can create. If you guys want to create a life full of abundance, you can go out there and do that. If you guys want to create a life where you're a professional musician, you guys 
can go out there and do that. If you guys want to create a life where you're a successful business owner, you guys can go out there and do that. If you guys want to be a YouTuber, you can go do it. If you want to be a TikToker, you can do it. And the biggest thing is you need to understand that you can create and be the creator of whatever it is that you guys want to, right? Anybody who's done something that has substantially put the world in a better place, right, which is obviously the overall goal of everybody is to, you know, or should be of everybody is to, you know, make this world a better place while they're on it and impact people no matter how many it is in a positive light. You don't have to be famous. You don't have to be a millionaire. You don't have to see a million people, but you just have to know that every single day, you know, you're putting something out there. You're putting positivity out there. You're sharing positivity with the world that's contagious and that's there to help other people. That's the most important thing behind success and feeling happy in general. Guys, I don't say this from a point of, oh, you know, I haven't experienced this stuff, right? When I was literally 16, I got started in dropshipping. I've been in this industry for about six years at this point. And when I was 16, started in drop shipping, I made a lot of money and I spent a lot of money on a lot of dumb stuff. And then I quickly realized what was really important and what was really important and what was really bringing me happiness was not the stuff, but it was, you know, actually being a creator of who I am. And every time I've lost sight of that, right, I felt depressed, I felt sad, I felt anxious, I felt stressed out, right, simply because I wasn't pursuing the things that I wanted to pursue on a daily basis. Or even if I was, I wasn't pursuing them with passion and you guys it's so important to have passion behind whatever it is that you do whatever it is you create before you do anything you have to believe in yourself and you have to know that it's a fact that you guys can literally get out there and create whatever it is for yourself that you want to create so that's the whole entire meaning behind the creator is basically you know be a creator of you but with that being said that's the story of my tattoo you guys